This coming week is Yom HaShoah, Holocaust Remembrance Day in Israel, but commemorated worldwide. A musical now on stage in New York is all about that, remembering, or in this case, teaching about a very famous group of comedians and singers you've never heard of thanks to the Nazis. The story's relevance today is chilling. These six brilliantly talented young men not only found musical harmony, but they found personal harmony. Even in their relationships, a Jewish fellow marries a Gentile woman, a Gentile member of the group marries a Jewish woman. It was harmonious in every way, standing in stark contrast to what was happening in the world around them. We don't know them in America, but they were so famous that the story is even weirder because what happened to them, they just disappeared. All their records were destroyed. Destroyed. All their movies, 12 movies, were burned. They just annihilated them after being so tremendously popular around the world. Harmony's relevance now is chilling, with war raging in Ukraine, innocent lives disrupted by hate. Doing this musical now, with everything going on, not just in the world, but with anti-Semitism on the rise. Unprecedented new levels of anti-Semitism, mm -hmm. yeah. yeah. I think one of the many joys about doing this show now is that it seems to be resonating right. more than ever. And that's remarkable that after everything we've been through that it's landing at this time. But, but it sounds very current. It sounds very current. And you can watch my special Being Barry Manilow on demand.